While millions of Christmas trees are sold each year, there are plenty that never make it into homes. Instead, they head back into the wild. 10 News reporter Gabrielle Hayes joins us with a look at how those unwanted trees are used and where you can see them once again. Gabrielle. Well, Robin, tomorrow more than 100 unused trees will go from the store to several habitats at the zoo. And zookeepers say it's quite a sight to see. Each holiday season, some trees are surrounded by gifts, while others are surrounded by red pandas. They went nuts, especially with these with these cubs. Here's why. It happens every year. A lot of the some of the big box stores have a surplus of Christmas trees, which presents a problem because they can't just sit at the store. So they go to the next best place, the wild. Well, kind of. It, it's something we can use to um, in so many different ways at, at the zoo. Phil is the director of animal care, conservation and education, and he knows a lot about animals and their love for trees. It's all enrichment for our animals. According to Phil, no animal habitat will be excluded, except maybe the reptiles. Oh, it's funny. I mean, uh, m most of it's funny. <laughs> However, the elephants might feel a little different. Our elephants, of course, will eat them, and a lot of our hoofstock will eat them. But not everyone will see a meal. A lot of the big cats will simply, they're fragrant, so they like lots of smells, so they'll roll around on them, they'll play on them, they'll carry them around. Surprised by that, so is Phil. You, know, you don't think of a big carnivore being interested in a, in a tree. After the animals are done, the leftovers will still get used. And they will go to our composting bin. For everyone looking at their Christmas tree right now, Phil wants you to know one thing. We've got plenty of trees too, so we don't, um, we, we don't necessarily need any more from the public. <laughs> That means please, please, please don't drop your trees off at the zoo. <laughs> and Phil says he believes there could be anywhere from 150 to as many as 400 trees delivered to the zoo tomorrow, and he expects the animals will have fun with those over the next couple of weeks. Robin Christmas just continues for the animals then. All right, Gabrielle, thanks.